All right, here we have a fully restored Packard 900 coupe. Uh, just to give you an idea of the finished product that we're working on here. And this is one uh, <coughs> where the interior wood has been re largely removed. Um, it's a fairly simple car and kind of unique in that most of the wood is held together with cast brackets, uh, which really helps in the process of uh, making joints because they're the most difficult part of a car to make. Um, I wish actually I had been able to, uh, or I was able, I just, I didn't uh, do a <coughs> anything preliminary, you know, here to show you what the inside of the car looked like before we started taking it apart, but there were big metal castings at the top of the door posts that were actually connectors between the uh, <clears throat> pillar and and this this piece that runs along the top here, um, and it it did they had to be kind of finessed apart. There were there were actually uh, nails that were spiral little spiral nails holding the sheet metal into the casting, but uh, <clears throat> you know anyway it's it's all apart now. And this is uh, the kind of wood we're using. It's uh, inch and three quarter ash. Uh, ash is a really good car wood, <clears throat> except that it will rot. Um, I personally, they never, I never ran across a car where white oak would, was used, but but that would to me be, you know, kind of an ideal wood to use. But ash is fine. It's reasonably priced. You can get it in all kinds of thicknesses. It's straight grained, <clears throat> and it's uh, traditional. So here we are. This is the side. That came out of the car in the, that you see in the picture, uh, the first, the second picture, um, <clears throat> and you can see where there was a casting here. And that casting held these parts together, um, and uh, <clears throat> we have to determine here what we're going to save and what can be saved, what's worth saving, what would take less time to actually remake. Um, and here's the first piece. <clears throat> that we're actually going to work on. It's uh, the piece running across the back that you see in the second picture um, of the cockpit, uh, defining the shape of the metal at the top. And uh, actually, I'm going to save the bottom part of it. I'm going to just cut the top off and redo it. <clears throat> 